Today I'll be showing you Lisa by Envy in the color Medium Blonde. Hi guys, welcome. So today I'm going to be showing you all this new release here by Envy. This is a part of their 2023 Spring Collection. They came out with three new styles. I have showed you guys Billy and Paula and now Lisa. All of the three, which one do y'all think's my favorite? <laughs> well, the smile's probably giving it away here, but most definitely Lisa is my favorite out of the three. The other two styles are so cute and gorgeous, except I am more of a mid-length, long-haired sort of gal. So I do like a little longer length on me personally. Although I do get in the mood to where I do like a cute short style, especially on those hot summer days that are coming. Oh gosh, I am so happy, y'all. It is spring. Okay, guys, so I'm bringing this review in partnership with Envy. So let's go ahead and talk about Lisa. Lisa is this cute little lob here. I just am gushing over this one. She is so pretty. I love this style and it's so lightweight. The fibers are of course those beautiful Envy fibers. She has the same fibers as Billy and Paula, which is a blend. She is a human hair synthetic blend and that's exactly what you're getting you're getting a blend of human hair and heat friendly synthetic fibers so when you're using your heating tools this girl can withstand temperatures up to 285 degrees fahrenheit i was thinking about going in and adding a little curl to lisa but I don't think I am. I, I Right now, anyways, I don't think I am. Just because, look at this little flip. <laughs> I like that. I, I'm just liking the straight, sleek look. So I'm probably just going to hold off on those curls for a little while. Okay, so Lisa has a ear-to-ear -ear lace front. This lace front is so, so well done. And... As many of you may know, I love my blondes. I love the blonde hair. And sometimes I'll get a lace front that it it doesn't look real natural. And I'm I'm being honest. And you know, the the knotting showing, if it's it has dark knots, it, it shows. And this one isn't doing that. It is actually just melting right into my my head as if it's just growing right out of my scalp. It's just very, very realistic. The cap is fitting me very, very comfortably. Now this is an average size cap. I am wearing a wig grip under here, not because I have to, just because I want to. It just gives me that added support and comfort that I'm used to now that I've been wearing my hair grip. So without it, I'm like, hmm. But this one fit, I did put it on without my hair grip just to see. And yes, I most definitely did have to use those adjustable straps and tighten it up to fit my petite size head measuring 21 inches in circumference. So with my wig grip, this, this is not going anywhere. Another thing I am loving about this is the side coverage, y'all. Look at this. It's just so, so nice. Now, I will say, if I was planning on just going out, like I'm going out on a date or whatever with my husband or just running errands or whatever, and I want to feel more secure and confident, I would probably use a little bit of my got to be glue or it stays and glue this down just a little bit. It doesn't really need glued down because it does have a silicone non-slip design cap, which is working really, really well. 
but I am the type of person that I put my hands in my hair. I just do. When I'm talking, doing whatever, I just do that. So I wouldn't want to do this and pull it back too much. And you could see maybe just a little bit. But if that was just glued down just a little, no problem. Problem solved. I personally would probably just put a little it stays or got to be glue or something on there. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the inside of Lisa's cap. Lisa features this beautifully done ear to ear lace front. She has this silicone non-slip design that follows the hairline. I love this new silicone that they added here. It really, really helps hold that wig in place for a more secure fit. She has bendable ear tabs here, adjustable straps, and she does have some bendable stays right here in the nape. That's going to help hug the back of your neck and lay that nape down more comfortably and secure to the back of your neck. I am loving those. She is open wefted throughout the rest of her cap and yes she does got some stretch on her. Lisa's measurements are the front here is eight and a half inches the sides are nine inches. That nape is right at eight inches. And the crown is 10 inches. And this girl weighs 4.34 ounces. Now let's take a look at her all the way around. The color medium blonde is a two-tone blend of 26, a soft golden blonde, and a 23 is a champagne blonde highlights. This is such a pretty color. Thank you guys so much for joining me today, but before you go, be sure to subscribe, share, like, and comment. And if you're over on Instagram or Facebook, you can find me there at Let's Talk With Kim. Stay well, my friends, and I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye, guys.